you know, have possibly drunk a glass of Peru. Then practically, you have to take things Another forward, I think, Hashmi. Half a metre. Oh. Right. What's wrong? We're not all here. Ah, who's missing? George. George. And he's starting George. discussion. Always late. How shown up this time, has he? He's not the kind of person we associate with. But he'll come. He always does. Hmm. Why don't we start with that? No, 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 no. I really think we ought to hear George exercise himself on the topic of social change. Sorry I'm late, sir. Oh, Been up all night finishing my paper. Get a chair. Could you possibly take my briefcase? Thank you. <laughs> Is that all right, sir? It'll do. I asked you to prepare this during the summer, not leave it till last night. Oh, I wanted it to be fresh. Anyway, I spent the summer shooting in Scotland. Ross? No. Evil? A film. <laughs> All right, let's get on with it, shall we? There is <laughs> a Just half a minute whilst I sort these books oh. out. Would you mind if I had a table? There's some just outside. I know, we put them up. What is all this stuff? Mm. Uh, now are you ready? Very nearly, sir. Oh. No, right. Ready, sir. Theories concerning the workings of social change with special reference to Mill, Marx and Weber. One moment. Yes, sir. Are you proposing to read all of that? Yes, sir. I am not, sir. I don't want your deference. Now, would you tell me what it was that I asked you to do? You asked me to read Mill, Marx and Weber and draw some conclusions. Yeah, and then I asked you to start off our seminar with a spontaneous verbal statement summarising your findings. Right. I did not ask for a formal paper the length, by the look of it, of a Victorian novel. Yes, I was going for something a bit more developed. Oh, I don't want anything developed. I want development to occur in discussion. I'm sorry, Dr Kirk. I felt this was better. Well, it's not. So put it away, take it outside and then briefly outline your impression. You think I haven't done the reading, mm. sir? <laughs> no, not at all. I just think you've made a heavy anal job of this because you're a heavy anal type. And I'd rather that you risk yourself in the insecurity of discussion. I'm sorry, sir. I can't do that. Oh, of oh, course you can. I know I'm an anal type. If you like, I'll bring a chit from counselling in future. They know I'm anal. <laughs> They told me I have a linear mind. Oh, linear, is it? Yes, it's a recognised mental condition. Well, shouldn't we have a shot at curing it? Right. No, no, Dr Kirk, I don't think they'd like that. Please let me read my paper. Oh, that's up to the rest of the class. We operate democratic principles here. We'll vote in it. Right. Mr Carmody wishes to submit a written paper. All those in favour of hearing it. How long is it? No discussion, just vote. Be fun. Be the half year. Against? Well, oh, you've won the consent of these tolerant people. Off you go. Theories concerning the workings of social change with special reference to Mill, Marx and Weber. They are. The very concept of social change is itself, in fact, an idea of relatively recent origin. Models of society developed by the early sociologists of the 19th century laid the stress on them. sociological thinkers. When, therefore, Marx remarks that what the bourgeoisie produces above all is its own gravediggers, the problem is more than anything else a question of hygiene. No, that's not right. 
I turned over two pages. Look, can I ask you a question? I'd much rather you waited till the end. I nearly finished. Now, just what is your methodology? All I'm doing understand. is making an objective summary. Yeah, but where's the ideology? It's dripping with it, man. The ideology of bourgeois self-justification. No, no, what I meant was the ideological self-awareness. Oh, the politics, you yeah. mean? Yeah. No, there isn't any of yeah. that. All I'm doing is taking a critical look at these critics of society. Listen, man, it's a paper that oh, hates life. Well, may That's I get a... on with no, it No, it won't do, George. I'm afraid it really is a very anal, repressed paper. <laughs> Your model of society is entirely static. It's simply not sociologically valid. I think it's a defensible point of view, sir. Uh, in conservative circles, perhaps, but not in sociological ones. Are you uh, sociology, then, Dr. Kirk? Yes, to all intents and purposes. But nothing I say could ever please you. Not until it? you try a good deal harder than you do. I see. You mean not until I vote the way you do? And march down the street with you and sign petitions and hit policemen. We don't insist on it, George, but it might help. It might prevent this relentless sentimentalising of our society that you indulge yourself in. See, the trouble is you haven't got a conflict in order to Oh, society. there's a lot more missing than that. Oh. There's no sociology and absolutely no humanity. It's all right to have a conflict model as long as we don't conflict with Dr Kirk. It's all right to be democratic as long as we all agree all right, sociology on. is revolutionary. No dirty old conservatives allowed. So let's forget the paper and start from scratch. Oh, do like I've had enough. Marx, Mill, and Weber topic. 